Yo, 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 what's up, man? It's the one and only hip hop game of Hot 97 Lock and Tech G. And since we talk about tech, welcome to Retro Tech. Yo, I want to give a big shout out to Marquez Brownlee, you know what I'm saying, in the building, my man Phil. Yo, wait till we talk to them and wait till you see what we got. But my man Champ is holding it down and he got something to show y'all. On that note, take a look. The first Mac, yo. Yeah, man, so look, I'm having a great time, and uh, make sure y'all stay tuned to YouTube, all right? All the Retro Tech episodes is out right now. But listen, I got something to show y'all. You Anybody remember Saved by the Bell from back in the day? I don't care how old you are, you gotta know my man Zach Morris. And if you know Zach Morris, and you know that episode with his dad, and he couldn't get in contact with him, check this out right now. This is the classic phone, yo. This is the Zach Morris right here, Saved by the Bell. Check it out. Uh, guess who's been Zach? It's not Beanie Siegel, J Hove. If you if you really know hip hop, you know that came from 50. You know what I'm saying? But look, one of my favorite movies was Old Dog. Shout out to Lorenz Tate. You know what I'm saying? And I had to mention 50 because Lorenz Tate is on what? Power. You already know what it is, man. But you know, even though that's power, we keep it hot over here, hot 97. Now look. Menace of Society, that's one of my favorite joints, man. You had Old Dog, you had Kane, and when he was in the classroom, you know what I'm saying? You know, he's getting beat, he's getting paid. You already know what that meant, but also you already know what 911 meant when you got that page, man. That's how we used to connect with each other back in the day. So it's amazing to see that, but even though I'm being filmed on this great Sony camera, I don't know what the name of it is, shout out to my man Champ holding it down, there's something else that I want to show y'all. So everybody that got skills in this new digital era, that's dope. But just like when you DJing, you know, a lot of people use laptops now, but back in the day when you see folk flex kick a pre, you know they had to they had to get those crates. So now we about to go digging digging the crate right now of technology or retro technology. Let's go. You can't tell me that I ain't lucky. You can't tell me that God don't love me. See this path, man, he paved it for me. All this drip, they can't take it from me. When it's cold, I be wearing sunny. All my walls look like Playboy bunnies. They don't funk if you ain't got no money. I'm from New York, it should happen, homie. My young boy is still clapping shit for me. I'm on the road, I'm in traffic, dummy. Just look, B. Just look. I remember this, man. Son, the hedgehog, but the not for resale. Did, like, I remember that, bro. This is crazy, you know what I'm saying? Street Fighter Championship Edition. I'm gonna tell you right now, like, you didn't play this game unless you had the six button controller. You know what I'm saying? A, B, C, X, Y, Z. If you ain't had that controller, you ain't truly played this game. You understand what I'm saying? So, this is amazing. Revenge of Shinobi. That was the game that um everybody was like, yo, this is crazy because you had Shinobi and you had Ninja Gaiden. You know what I'm saying? It was Ninja Gaiden, Shinobi, Shinobi, Ninja Gaiden. That was the battle. I know y'all remember that. You know what I'm saying? Now, um, you know what's so funny? I don't remember this game. Wait, what game is this? Oh, oh yes, I do. Shining Force. I just didn't remember the um front cover. But Shining Force, that was another one that was crazy. Echo the um Echo the Dolphin. I never played that one that much, but it is a classic. You know what I'm saying? So, yo, this is what we do, man. Retro Tech, showing love to where we came from so we can appreciate what we got today. And there's more to look forward to in the future. So, let's go, baby. What's up, man? It's the one and only hip-hop game of Hot 9-7. Logitech G. Phil is in the building, son. Phil is in the building, man. All day, Brooklyn stand up. You gotta hold the bell on the next question, bro. Now, I'm a gamer, you know what I'm saying? Hardcore, this is what I do, I'm a gamer, man. So, I gotta ask you this, man. Please let me know. But, there was a game that came out by Mark Echo a while back. Mark Echo was getting it up because of all the graffiti and everything like that, and there was a story to it. So, with photography, have you thought about, um, you know, working with a video game company to make Yo, let, yo, yo, he already getting excited. I'm excited too. Talk to me, man. Like, that would be crazy. That what would, would that be like for you, or is that something that you want to tell your story on in that way? This is the game right here. It's the game Let's right do it right here. Right here. Right here. So the game is, you got to find that person, whoever you got to find. You got to find them, and you got to take their picture. After you take their picture, you got to go with them on a the journey. Yo, yo, I'm going to tell you something right now. The reason why I asked you that question is because I'm not sure if you ever heard of this particular game. But there's a game called...
called Life is Strange, um, published by Square Enix, made by Don't Nod. Those are my peoples over there. And you play as um, this girl named Chloe, and you're a female in college, and you're a photographer. But the thing is, when you take pictures, whatever picture it is, you can go into that moment and play it out. So let's say you took a picture of Jay Z. Uh, I mean, I know you have, but so you let's say you took a picture. But when people watch it, they wasn't they wasn't there. Yeah, exactly. But now that's you can go it. into that moment and play it. That's exactly what the picture is. Yeah, yeah it's, it's a flashback into that moment. Yeah, so you can tell that story because you was there. Yeah, people exactly. want to know the story because you was there. Maybe you were there. So you're interested in being able to take your talent into the game. Oh, right. Hell yeah. So we gotta talk. <laughs> favorite artist, favorite video game. Say it home, baby, you already know what it is. Favorite game. Favorite game. Favorite game is Metal Gear Solid. Woo! Metal Gear Solid? Yo, 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 oh my god. That's a, yo, shout out to Hideo Kojima. You know what I'm saying? I interviewed him before as well. Of course, man, this is what I do for real. So look, I just want to say one love. God bless, you know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all stay tuned to Retro Tech. It's out now on YouTube. Make sure you, oh, let them know where they can find you at, bro. Yeah, 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 well, we, we, we love. Polaroidsofpeople.com, Polaroid.pv on Instagram, Polaroids of People PPL on Instagram. And uh, you know, I'm here. You can find me in the streets too. I'm in the streets. I ain't hard to find. We outside, baby. We outside. You know what I'm saying? Doing that positive grind, alright? We outside. One love and God bless, man. I'm gonna talk to y'all soon. We got game and we got you. Let's get it. Uh.